your time starts now. Every year, a huge number of new drugs and chemicals have been developed or discovered in order to improve the medical and the healthcare condition of the people. But before the final approval of these new drugs and chemicals, they have to pass through the different steps of testing. Among these steps, the study of their poisoning effect, which we also call the toxicity testing, is very important to move further, mainly during the beginning or the initial phase of the testing. And the use of live animal for such kind of testing is always considered as a gold standard. But at the same time, the use of live animal has some problem, including the ethical issue, a very high cost, and the long time period. To overcome this limitation, the researcher or the scientist came with a new idea of creating the three-dimensional cell model, where this model can be used as a device to perform the same test, but outside of the animal body. That means there is no more need to use the live animal for the testing, which ultimately helps to reduce the overall cost of the testing during the research. It's a great, right? But though the various type of cell model have been developed, not all these models have been accepted or recommended as a standard for the testing. And hence, there is still a need either to improve this existing model or to create the new one. And this is the need which I am trying to fulfill in my PhD research. In my PhD research, we created the three-dimensional microsphere of the liver cell where the liver cells are entrapped inside the gel network of the alginate and the chitin polymer. And these natural polymers are not harmful to the cell. At the same time, they provide a similar environment to the cell as inside the real animal body. Hence, we believe the model which we develop could be used as a potential cell model or a device to perform the poisoning effect study of these new drugs and chemicals, which ultimately helps to reduce the overall global cost of the testing for the research. In addition to that, this model could also have been used as a bio-artificial liver and the liver tissue engineer. Thank you.